Welcome to the Sage 50 Cloud Pastel Accounting Self-Help video. In this video, we will demonstrate how to check that the version of Pervasive you have installed is the same as the version of Pervasive that you are licensed to use. Please note, this is only important if you are running a multi-user environment, i.e. more than one user. If you are not running, the version of Pervasive that you are licensed to use in a multi-user environment. This may lead to certain errors like error code 20, status 116 or status 161. This is why it is important to install the version that you are licensed to use. Should you be receiving any one of those errors and are unable to open your Pastel program on the machine that is affected, please go to another machine and open your Sage program. Once your Pastel program has opened, you will then click on Help and About. Look under Pervasive Engine and you will see the version of Pervasive that you are licensed to use. In this case, Workgroup version 13. You can now close the Pastel program and go back to the machine that you are receiving the error on and navigate to your control panel. Once you have opened your control panel, change the view bar to large or small icons and then look for programs and features. Once you have opened your program and features, you will wait for all of the programs that are installed to load. You are then going to look for either Actium version 13 workgroup engine or Actium version 13 server or client. This will be under A. Or if you are running version 10, you will scroll down until you get to P and you will look for pervasive. Again, ensure that both the version and the type are correct. In this case, Workgroup version 13. I have installed the version that I am licensed to use. However, if I had, for example, Pervasive 10 or version 13 server or clients, I would need to uninstall these versions and install the correct version. In this case, my version is correct.